No, I'm afraid not, but we will keep that sunshine, actually. Thank you very much, Mary. Hello, a very good evening to you. Well, yes, that sunshine had a positive effect on temperatures today. Where we got it, we saw highs of 15 Celsius. That said, across Shawbury and Shropshire, we still saw 15 Celsius, despite the cloud. But this wasn't the case everywhere. In the south of the region, where we had more in the way of rain, we saw tops of uh, 11 Celsius and those temperatures are going to be slipping even further as the week goes on. So it's a week of two halves. Uh, we start off with milder conditions as we saw today, some rain as well, but then turning drier but colder as the week progresses and we could also see some night frosts, but there will be plenty of sunshine on offer. Now this is what's going on in the background. We've got a blocking high which is going to develop in the east. It's going to draw in an easterly wind which is why the temperatures are slipping, but it's also going to fend off that area of low pressure to the west and its associated fronts. So uh, this is the rain that's across us at the moment. It's moving southwards by the time we get to tomorrow, but let's take a closer look at it because it will be affecting us. It's affected uh, southern parts of the region today, central parts as well, but it's the north that will see the driest conditions overnight and some clearer spells there. We could get some mist patches into the morning tomorrow, but that cloud and that rain will linger across southern parts and temperatures under that cloud and that rain around five to seven Celsius, so holding up. So that uh, cloud and rain lingering into the morning tomorrow, but the whole lot starts to slip slowly southwards and we'll see an improvement across all parts by the time we get to the afternoon and some pleasant spells of sunshine as well. But temperatures will start to suffer a little in the north of the region, 13 Celsius here, 14 Celsius in the south and a noticeable breeze. Um, as we head into tomorrow night though, this is when we start to notice the difference. Clearer skies and temperatures starting to fall, so around two to four Celsius a chillier night in prospect and as I say as the week goes on those night values will fall even further giving us some night frost.